What's up, everyone? I beg you to another video. No, but this one, I'm ranking all of the Spider Man movies from worst to best, and of course, I'm including Venom and Venom Let There Be Carnage and Spider, Spider Man Into the Mold. I mean, Spider Man Into the Spider Verse, and um, and of course, Spider Man No Way Home. So, yeah, I'm a huge Spider Man fan. Spider Man is my favorite superhero of all time. He's my favorite Marvel character of all time. So yeah, and let's begin. Coming at my number 11 is the original Venom. Now, I enjoyed this film. It's just my least favorite. I enjoyed this film. This film actually had that late 2000, like early 2000s vibe um, to it. Like this movie felt 2000s, very 2000s. And um, I enjoyed this film. It's not perfect by any means, but it is my least favorite, but there are some things I like about this film. As a matter of fact, I think it's underrated, because a lot of people really hate this film. Coming in at my number 10 is The Amazing Spider-Man. Now, I actually really enjoyed this suit. I actually really enjoyed this suit um, that Spider-Man had in this film. And Andrew Garfield is a great Spider-Man, in my opinion. Um, but... Yeah, I enjoyed this film. Um, the action was pretty damn good. The soundtrack was pretty damn good. The story was decent. It was okay. But yeah, um, it's it's a good watch. It's a decent watch. Coming in at my number nine is The Amazing Spider-Man 2. Now, I remember I freaking loved the hell out of this film when it first came out. Um, Electro, I actually loved that blue look of Electro. And I really love this movie a lot. Like, I used to love it a lot more, but, like, I, I enjoy this movie now, but not as much as I did bef back then when I first saw it in the theater. But, yeah, it's, it's, it's okay, you know. It's good. It's better than the first Amazing Spider-Man, but this film kind of felt a little messy at times. So, yeah. So, that's why this is going to be staying at number nine. Coming in, my, coming in at my number eight is Venom, Let There Be Carnage. Now, I really don't understand the hate about this movie. Um, I enjoyed this movie a lot. This movie has some great action scenes. And Woody Harrelson as Carnage, when he played Carnage in this film, like Woody Harrelson did a great job in my opinion. And Carnage was actually menacing. So I don't know what the hell kind of movie everybody else was watching. Because when I watched the movie, when Carnage showed up, he messed everything up. Like when when um when Woody Harrelson turned into Carnage, destruction starts happening. So yeah, I enjoyed this movie. I don't understand the hate about it. Um this movie is underrated in my opinion. I enjoyed this movie. Even better than the first man. Coming in at my number seven. Is Spider Man Homecoming? Now, I really enjoyed this movie, but I don't like as much as a lot of people love it. But I thought this movie was okay. But, um, but yeah, like this is the weakest out of the Tom Holland Spider Man trilogy, in my opinion. But I enjoy it. Um, it's an okay film, it's funny at times. The action was okay, so yeah. It was, it was a good movie. It wasn't perfect at all, though. It was a good movie. Now, this is what I need to explain myself. Coming in at number six is Spider-Man 3. Now, a lot of people think that this is the worst Spider-Man movie out of all of them. Like, a lot of people consider this is the worst one. Not to me. Um, I love the Tobey Maguire Spider-Man trilogy. Or Sam Raimi, I should say. They created this trilogy um, a lot. And Spider-Man 3 does have a lot of flaws. But I put those flaws aside and enjoy the movie for what it is. That's what I do with this film. This film still has a lot of the emotions like the first two Spider-Man movies had. And it still had some good action scenes like the first two Spider-Man movies had. But this film, let's face it, it's all over the place. But I still thought this film was a good movie. Or a decent movie. Now, these 
these next five movies were hard to pick which one's my favorite. So coming in at my number five is Spider-Man Far From Home. Now, this movie, um, it seems like the Tom Holland trilogy kept getting better and better, more entertaining and more interesting. Because um, to me, it seems like leading up to Spider-Man Far From Home, they're leading up to something bigger and better. So, Spider-Man Far From Home did have some good action scenes, did have some good, you know, character moments, but I really enjoyed this movie a lot. Um, I enjoyed it better than Spider-Man Homecoming. Um, so, yeah, I really enjoyed this movie a lot. Coming in at my number four has to go to Spider-Man Into the Spider-Verse. Now, Spider-Man Into the Spider-Verse... I really enjoyed this movie, one of the best animated movies that ever came out in a long, long time. And um, this is one of the best Spider-Man movies, <laughs> one of the best. And I really um, enjoyed this movie a lot. Um, so yeah, the animation and everything was amazing. The comedy scenes every once in a while in this film was amazing. So yeah, I enjoyed this film. I really don't have much flaws to say about this film other than I really, really enjoyed this film. Coming in at my number three is my top three now. These three was freaking hard to make. I'm like, which one of these are better? Coming in at my number three is, this is a fan favorite for everyone pretty much. It's Spider-Man 2. Now, I enjoyed this movie. Is it my favorite? No, it's um, it almost went to my favorite. But I enjoyed this movie. The action, the emotions were there. The freaking the fight scenes were awesome. Like, I, I enjoyed this film, but it's not my favorite Spider-Man movie, but I enjoyed it. It was close to being my favorite, but yeah, I, I love Spider-Man too. Um, I grew up with it. I grew up with the Sam Raimi trilogy of Spider-Man. So yeah, um, Spider-Man 2, damn good. I love this movie. Whew. Now, this is where it gets tricky, because we have the original Spider-Man and Spider-Man No Way Home. Now, these two movies... You switch out at any time because I gotta watch Spider Man No Way Home again and see where it lands. But for right now, the original Spider Man is at my number two. Now the original Spider Man is really one of the best one of the best origin stories in superhero history in my opinion. Um and the action in this film was great. Green Goblin was awesome. Um so yeah, I enjoyed the original Spider-Man a lot. Um, so yeah, it had to be at my it had to go somewhere, and it's at my number two. Um, it was hard for me to choose between the original and Spider-Man: No Way Home. So yeah, I enjoyed this movie a lot. One of my all-time favorite superhero movies. The original Spider-Man is freaking awesome and epic, and great story. I enjoyed this film a lot. Now we go to my number one for right now, and that is. Spider-Man No Way Home. Like, when when I say epic, I mean it is epic. Epic in scale, epic as in a lot of action, and the action was top-notch violence. And the story, I really do appreciate the story, and the film was awesome. And Green Goblin was awesome in this film. And this might be Tom Holland's best acting performance in this film. Um, like, Spider-Man No Way Home blew my damn mind. I, didn't, I did not expect this to blow my mind the way that it did. Because um, I'm like half speechless. I got the review up. If y'all want to hear my full thoughts on Spider-Man No Way Home, a review is up on YouTube. But yeah, I enjoyed this film a lot. Um, it could change at any time if I watch it again. But as of right now, it's at my number one. I'm just speechless of how great and awesome and action-packed and emotional this film was. It's awesome. This movie is going to go down in history as one of the greatest superhero movies of all time. I just can't believe how good this movie was. Like, 
is really good. So yeah, I do got the review up on YouTube. So if y'all want to hear my full, full on thoughts, Spider Man No Way Home, check that review out. So yeah, I guess that's it for this video. Let me know in the comments below how would y'all rank the Spider Man movies for more's the best. So yeah, I like the um, I like to see y'all's rankings down below. So yeah, I guess that's it for this video. If y'all enjoyed this video, please hit the like button, please subscribe and share, and also hit the bell so you know when new videos upload. Peace out. Hope y'all enjoyed this video. And I'm out. Peace.